Welcome back to Thimbleweed Park. We are trying to call in here and win something. Though she's not announcing the competition. Ah well, we've tried um, shutting off the phone behind there. Maybe... Well, we'll have to try and call. Oh wow, didn't see that before. And we couldn't call from the uh, office there. The sheriff's office. And we couldn't... Well, we don't have the phone book. Let's look at the phone book over here and see if we can find case gum in there. I think I did check it before, but I couldn't find it. Let's look at it. Let's check it. K. I think that's... What? It's right here. Case gum radio 7286. Let's try 7286. Oh, well. I haven't got a phone. Oh, I guess actually... Dolores has got it. Yeah, she's got it. 7286. 7286. We're sorry. The number you have dialed is not in service at this time. No? Was it the wrong number? Let's check again. 7286 was what I called. Yeah, that's it. Uh... Press right. Didn't we take a tube from there? Maybe we should go and put it back. Yeah, yeah, it's not there. So let's put it back. Put this tube into there. Okay. KSCUM's phone system is now rebooting. Oh, nice. Okay. So, well, we don't have phone. Oh, she's got a phone. Yeah. So let's try There's that. There's too much interference to get a cell signal. Well, where can we get a phone? There were phones at the hotel. And we are there. 1204, 1203. Okay, this is our room. Use the keycard. We're in. And there's a phone, yes, okay. So let's use 72... 86. All circuits are busy. Please try again later. Oh. Well... We could just, um, we have, we have got this still here, right? There it is. We have got this tube puller. Pull it off. KSCUM's phone system is now out of order. So we put it back in, it should reboot, right? KSCUM's phone system is now rebooting. So if we're quick, maybe we can get there first. Oh, it's ringing. Hello, caller. You're live on KSCUM. Hello. Nice. Correctly answer two out of three questions to win four ThimbleCon 87 tickets. Four. Your first question is, what was Jenny's phone number? What? Uh, what Jenny? Let's try a different one. Oh, I'm sorry. That's not the right answer. Here's your second question. Which volcano erupted in 1980? What? That's before I was born. Pompeii. Uh, 1980. St. Helens? Krakatoa. Krakatoa was later, no? Let's try this. You got it right! Yes. And your final question. What popular weekly radio show does Casey Kasem host? Casey Kasem? In America? Well, that's impossible for me to know. American Top... Got Music, I don't think it's that. America's Top Hits, Loves Musics. That seems weird. American Top 40, let's do that. You got it! Yeah! Let's see how you did. You got two out of three! Close enough for a win. 
You win four ThimbleCon 87 tickets. Oh, you yeah. You can pick them up at the Edmund Hotel front desk. What's your name? Uh, my name. Is, uh... <laughs> Kai is to me. Thank you, and congratulations. Now back to our regularly scheduled hostile takeover of the airwaves. All right, so we can pick up the tickets now. So we can get into the con. So we have to go down to the bottom again. And we can pick them up. Welcome Hello. to the Edmund Hotel. Most beautiful hotel abu in the Tri-Thimbleweed Park County area. How may I be a boo of service? Well, there should be some ThimbleCon tickets in my name. Yes, I do have tickets from the Case Gumaboo Trivia Contest. What is your name, Abu, please? Ah, yes, here's your name, Abu, on the list. How else may I be a boo of service? Thank you. Hello, Sheriff. Why are you moonlighting as the hotel manager? No, oh, Abu, uh, I'm not the sheriff, I'm the hotel manager. Uh, the sheriff says that annoying areno thing all the time. You'll never hear me doing that, Abu. Sure. Whatever. Well, now something is going on in the hotel. Is anything going on in the hotel today? Thimblecon Abu opened to record Abu crowds. Was the record that only two people showed up? If you'd kindly refrain from voicing every thought out loud, I, for one, Abu, would be very happy. Other than ThimbleCon? Nothing, Abu. Uh, certainly not more cases of food poisoning. Definitely not, Abu. Good. I'm going to check out your, um, interesting lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening, Abu. Okay, we've got four tickets to ThimbleCon, and... Actually, I think most of all, it's Ransom that needs to get there. So we'll run Ransom over there. Um, it's a hotel. Run! Quickly! Oh, there's balloons around there. Okay, so here we go. She can give him a ticket. You can't carry this Don't you want... He wants... Come on. Shut up in there! No one will ever carry a computer around in their pocket. None shall pass without showing me their ticket first. Oh, and welcome to ThimbleCon, of course. Here Here's is my ticket. Thank you. I'll take the tickets for your friends while you're here. Saves time so you can live long and proper. Yeah, prosper. What? No. Oh. Do you need some cosplay advice? Oh, it's you. Beep off. I'm not cosplaying. Go away. I quit, so I don't need to deal with you anymore. Uh, sure. Oh, this is comic. Pew, pew, pew. So maybe I could give this comic to this guy. Maybe you'll be interested in Look at my first publishing. edition comic book of me. It's got to be worth a fortune. Wow. A first edition Ransom the Clown comic? After his total meltdown, that's become a collector's item. You almost look like him. Except your costume is pretty crappy. I'll trade you the priceless Colossal Dungeon Cave Quest 2 hint guide for it. What a ripoff. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, we got it. Yeah. Is it? Whoa. Oh. Well, I can pretty much read it. Famed text adventure game designer Ron Gilbert was, <laughs> of course, was. What does he say there? C quoted, I think, as saying that text adventures are here to stay. The fad of doing graphics will die soon enough. <laughs> well, I think we need this red gel decoder for that, maybe. Action figures. Pew, pew, pew. Bottled starships. I don't know, but we can go in here. Or you can even talk to these guys. He's Cory. Uh, 
friend is Corey. And not to be a rude ransom, but we're trying to get into character for the look-alike contest. Yeah, so get out of here. <laughs> Good one, Corey. For a moment, I thought you were Ransom the Clown. Amateurs. Wow! No need to start swearing. And get a better Maybe. costume! It's like you're not even trying! Ooh, burn! Really? I need my joke book in perfect condition before I enter the contest. He needs his joke book? What, is that back at the circus, maybe? Oh. Someone's spying on us again. What? Oh. Oh, is she in on it? I knew it. She was always so suspicious. She wasn't selling anything. She was still making a living. So they are making an AI of him. No, did they capture him? We need, need to get to the corner. <sighs> Shut up this. in there! Ninjas fight alone! Pirates will always beat them! <laughs> okay. That is a common discussion item, I guess. Let's go and rescue... Rescue Reyes again. Oh, yes, he was down in the coroner's place. Maybe we can peek around the corner or something. No, he's not here. Huh. He was here just now. Wasn't he? Let's look up at the sheriff's, op sheriff's office. Still nobody here. No. Oh. Let's go out then. I think that she... Dolores will have to get... Get the lawyer now. We have to get this over with. Come on. So... She'll go back to here, and she can get a ticket. Thanks a lot. That's good. Actually, she can get all. She can... Oh, wait. We need to ch change. So, we need to give all the tickets. Thanks. One ticket for ThimbleCon87. Oh, whoops. Yeah. Thank you. Dolores can take all of them. And then she can go to the hotel, and then the dragon will keep all the other tickets, leftover tickets. So maybe she's actually in the will, anyway. Or is something completely different? Who knows? Oh, okay, so now he took all the tickets, yeah. Do you need some cosplay advice? Oh, hi Dolores. What brings you back to Thimbleweed Park? I need you to read Uncle Chuck's will. Chuck never paid me to read his will. My fee was $15,000 and I didn't see a cent of that Whoa. money. I'm sure he must have paid you. It's not like Uncle Chuck to forget something like that. Unless I see proof, I won't believe it. How else can I help you, Dolores? Proof? Are you an expert on cosplay as well? Just the legalities of cosplay. It's a fascinating intellectual property question. By cosplaying, you appear to represent the company, so their trademark... That's okay. I don't need to know the details. How else can I help you, Dolores? Well, Bye. See you later, Dolores. Can I give this lawyer's card to... He doesn't want it. No. Pew, pew, pew. But how can I find proof? Well, in the books, maybe. If I go back to the mansion and check the books... Whatever they were called, checking books or something, I don't know. I seem to use a lot of checks in America. But maybe it was the books, actually. Check register. I'm not going to carry this big checkbook around. Well, look at it. It's then. Uncle Chuck's check register. Can you open it? Oh, yeah. 
There's a stub there. It's a stub from a check that Uncle Chuck wrote. It's the stub of a check that was made out to an attorney, Brant Balowick. Payment in full for will and reading. There we go. So he was lying, obviously. And I guess all the people wanting to know about the legalities of cosplay um, will have to wait. What good is a check stub? It doesn't prove anything. I'd need the actual cancelled check as proof. Really? So I have to go to the bank, I guess. That's silly. I don't know what check stub is, really. Or a cancel check? What was it cancelled? Does that mean that it has been used? That he has taken the money or something? Well, we'll see. We'll visit the bank. Should be here. And uh, show him the stub. Hello, Safely First Savings. Your money is in our hands. What's with all the heavy breathing and moaning? These obscene folk calls are getting annoying. No, give this stub to him. Yes, how can I help you, Miss Edmund? Can you help me with this check stub? Oh, yes. This handwriting brings back a flood of memories. Too bad about Mr. Edmund. He was such a wonderful man. Yes? Excuse me. I'm sorry, how can I help you? I need a copy of the check that goes with this stub. Yes, I believe I kept all of Mr. Edmund's cancelled checks right here. Is it there? Here it is. Oh, great. Thank you. Hello, Safely First Savings. Your money is in our hands. I almost thought it was not going to be there. I have a cancelled check for you. It clearly says that you were paid by Uncle Chuck to read the will. That it does. My apologies. I'll go to the Mansion Mansion right away. Great. Finally. Finally, we'll be able to see what the will is about. Finally, finally. But, we'll do that next time. So, see you then. Bye-bye.